Kamu kodein aja kalau udah rolling, aku iya. juga. Ini udah udah gue hidupin. Udah roll semua kok. Udah roll. Oke, okay. aku record ya. Iya, i. Tunggu, tunggu, tunggu. Halo. <laughs> What's up, dude? Uh, not much, man. Back to the big city. Yeah. From the jungle. Yeah, from the jungle. Seven months in the jungle. Seven months. Seven months in Papua. That's fucking insane, bro. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Um, yeah. So I so. Mean, there are there are moments you enjoy, and of course there are moments you don't enjoy. Yeah, like it's every, work. Every, it's every, work. Exactly, right? it's yeah. work. And because it's work, you have to find out ways on how you can make yourself enjoy it. Yes. Because if it, you just rely on work itself to get the money only, then you know, it's gonna yeah. be. It's gonna feel like it's even longer there. Yes, of course. So even if you don't enjoy it, you have to try your best to enjoy it. Exactly. So it did it feel like seven months? Did it feel like longer? Or did it just fly? Oh, uh, it felt like seven months. <laughs> <laughs> but um, oh, originally, I was supposed to be there for four months, right? Uh, and my first four months there, it just went by like real quick. Because you're learning a bunch of new shit. And exactly. Like, because I knew different. there. Yeah, I, yeah. I knew nothing about the place. I knew nothing about like I knew nothing about. Papua, I knew nothing yeah, about like course. the politics. First time knew, there as well. First yeah. time there. So like I had <laughs> so much cu curiosity mm. of the place and learning and I wanted to learn. Yeah, I yeah, had yeah. nothing to do there but learn about okay. everything. Great. And that's what made it like that's what made time just zoom by. Of course. Wait, before you continue though, can you explain to uh, everyone, especially Dennis actually because you remember we worked with Dennis before, right? Yes, of course. And the first homie. time I introduced you to him, yes. I said, "Yeah, ini teman gua, dia actor, bintang film, main oh, sinetron, main iklan." I see. Jadi pas gua ceritain lu baru balik dari hutan, he was like, "What the fuck? Is he shooting like? Is he shooting? What's he doing?" Because also there are some fans, right? Yeah, yeah. That, like I I I've been stalking your Instagram page to get right. content, right? right? And every post, even if it's not related to like work or like uh, the entertainment industry, you have random people commenting, yes. asking like, Kak Jawhar, kapan masuk TV lagi? Like, Kak Jawhar, kok udah gak main? Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, and I know you're not the, you don't have a PR team with you, right? You don't have a PR team? I do, but they don't like me because I, I told them I want to be autonomous on my own there you go. social media. Yeah. But then it turns out I don't do shit. <laughs> exactly. That's so, what I'm saying. So you're not that type, right? So you don't update as much. No, you don't I announce don't. to the world. No. So maybe you can to maybe explain where your life is headed currently okay, and everything. Okay, okay, okay. So um, I was an actor. I was in the entertainment business for a few years. I did a few sinatrons. I did a movie. Uh, I was doing that for about... Five years? Five mm. years on and off? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> it was really successful my first three years. Like, I got work. Oh, you like, snowballed, bro. You yeah. snowballed. Like, the first, my first time in, I got job after job yes. after job I after job. That. And I was making pretty good money, man. Mm. And then, but the whole point of me going to, to uh, be an actor, the grand scheme was so that I could finance myself for ed for university. Okay, that was your vision originally. That was my original okay. vision. That's why I did acting. Yes. And so it took me three years to to gather up all the money to pay for my tuition. I mean, fee. that's pretty fast, though. But yeah, continue. Yeah, yeah. especially international. Yes, fee? exactly. Holy shit, exactly. Bro, that's, that's expensive. It's fat. I know. So I was doing that for three years. I made the money, and that's when I went to Netherlands to yes. study. Yes. Twente, right? Twente yes. University. Yes. 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 Before you said. Uh, I was an actor, right? Was it past tense, right? Yes. This whole time I thought like maybe, um, you know, with Sinatron and movies, like maybe the schedule is super fucking hectic. Mm -hmm. But like with like modeling or like iklan, itu kan biasanya lu kayak datang sehari dua hari syuting selesai, ya kan? Yeah. Jadi mungkin selama ini gua kira itu kayak part time gitu loh. Jadi lu misalnya enam bulan di Papua, terus dua bulan di sini, sambil di sini lu bisa nyari pekerjaan oh. lain. Atau benar-benar lu udah 100% ninggal dunia itu. Mm. Untuk sementara sih gue pingin keluar dari itu dulu. Gue nggak mau lanjutin acting untuk sementara. One of the main reasons on why I took this drone job was because I wasn't getting that many jobs in early 2020 and then COVID hit 
And yeah, it was like even worse. Market. And everyone was losing their jobs. Yeah. And that's when I got an offer. Like since 2017, I had an offer to fly drones. But I, I've always been working. I've always mm. had something going on. So I always declined. Yeah, yeah, of Until course. COVID hit, people started losing their jobs. I didn't get any jobs. Mm. So I called up Dom, which was my friend who, was, who has been offering me this job. I'm like, Dom. You still got a slot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, fuck yeah, for you. <laughs> of course, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. So uh, okay. I took it. I took it. Right right as COVID hit, um, lockdown started in March, and I started in April. Was it like a fallback plan? Well, was it like okay, a retirement okay, plan? Yeah. No, no. It was, it was because I snowballed, right? Yes. But then towards the end, when I came back from university, I got less and less jobs. It became mm. less and less frequent, which also demotivated me to stay inside the entertainment industry because it made me think like why why am i not getting jobs is it because oh, it's I'm not, not as stable enough? as you think maybe yeah they... well i know it's not stable but i started doubting myself with my capabilities within that field uh, like am i good enough to be an actor because like at that time i was also struggling with like some mental health which really doesn't help <laughs> yeah you know <laughs> with anything <laughs> <laughs> and um yeah, I just got less and less jobs and I blamed myself for it. Gua ngerasa nggak pede. But looking back now, like after you've you've had a lot of headspace time to think, right? Do you think it was mostly yourself or was it just the market at the at the time? Oh, it was myself. It was for it was sure. Myself. But you enjoy your current job, that's the most important thing, right? As a drone pilot? Yes. Sometimes. <laughs> I mean, I mean, cuz it's a crazy experience. It's not a desk job. It's not you know? a desk job, no. It, it, it's a desk job has some is something which I've always told myself I'm never gonna yeah, get a desk yeah, job. Yeah, you know? yeah. You'd rather be fucking dead on the sidewalk. <laughs> <laughs> so I've always been wondering as well. You know, like is the <laughs> where's the just take your water bottle there. Yeah. Is this cool? Yeah, of course. Um, do I have to do it outside? No, no, no. All right. Yeah. No, that that paints a picture for me. That's pretty good. Gosh, come on. <laughs> uninstalled, uh, uninstalled Bumble. <laughs> uninstalled Bumble. I did. Yeah, why, Joe? Because she ghosted me. Yeah. <laughs> on, the day, on the day of the date. <laughs> That's wrong? Yeah. That's wrong. Wait, wait, wait. Um, the issue. Joe, uninstalling Bumble. No, we're not talking about <laughs> that. I'm not talking about that. No, 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 no. Put him on the market, bro. <laughs> 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 My boy for sale. So. It's gonna be inherently funny because it's Jao Hard, we know Jao Hard. Yeah. But try to find the one thing that makes that that for me is like the icing on the cake. Do you know I think the quality was not good enough to be able to see what you wanted? No no no, sure. it is, it is, definitely. I've I've looked at it a million times. They're right there. <laughs> you know that's not his teeth, right? No way. It's not his teeth. No way. It's not my teeth. They edited it. Yeah, yeah dude. Teeth. No way. Yeah, you got sharp back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> dude, dude, can you can you grin? Cause on the thing, I'm gonna put like a side by side <laughs> right. comparison. All right. Wait, wait. Show all your teeth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Beda banget, dude. Sumpah. <laughs> 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 you, you know, honestly, I don't, I don't even yeah, care yeah. that they changed my teeth. Right? I don't care. I got paid. Great. Exactly. <laughs> that leads directly to what I was gonna ask you, right? Because, you know, like, um, some models, some models, they get edited, like mm -hmm. whether to look taller, to look skinnier, right, 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 or just right, right. To, to conform with social right, norms and all that. Right? Right, right. There's two different ways to look at it, right? The first way, and, and they're both equally right, you know, equally in justifiable, you know? One is like, bro, you paid for me, I auditioned, and you accepted, you accepted, you accepted me, me as I am. As I am! Right. What the fuck are you doing, right. you know? Like, obviously, this is just teeth, but it can, like, to varying degrees, like, it's the same concept. Like, my body weight, or my height, or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. But on the other hand, it's like, bro, you paid me, mm -hmm. you're the production house, mm -hmm. My job is done, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Which one are you and why? As long as I get paid. And as long as long <laughs> as it's still they they put credit 
like I'm my name is there. Yeah, yeah. And everything, then I don't care. You don't care. I don't care. You were you offended at all? No, I just realized I might need better team. <laughs> Did you, did you know, like, did the production house tell you? No, they didn't know. Manager they, tell I had, you? They, I had no clue, bro. So you just saw it one day? And I right? just saw, I just saw, of course, like, when, when it come, like, when I finish shooting, I ask them, like, when's it gonna come out? And then they, they tell me, and then sometimes they just WhatsApp me, hey, bro, it's out. Just yeah, yeah, it yeah, out. yeah, yeah. Like, so I check it out, and my first time seeing it, like, it just struck out, like, those aren't my teeth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're not my teeth. So you had no idea. I had no idea, but I wasn't, I wasn't, like, Disappointed or anything. I thought it was pretty hilarious. Yeah, you actually. had a good laugh. Like. Yeah, I thought it was pretty funny, but like That's not my team. Oh, yeah, <laughs> dude. It's not even like uh, It wasn't even a call gate commercial or like some like anything to do with teeth like no I think they would have been fine if they left your fucking teeth. No, in, I think I think it's because my teeth are my teeth are small Okay, so it's like not too Like you can't really see it that well during that scene or something, uh, I don't know. And they wanted you to grin and look yeah, like... Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. exactly. Do you, do you remember your first time um, on TV? Like, whether it's a Sinatron or an Eclan or... What was your the first time your face was on television? The first time I was on TV was a advertisement. Eclan. For what? Um, Obeha. Obat Batuk Obeha. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Did that you do anything? Time. What did you do? I coughed. <laughs> uh, I then, coughed and they gave me Obeha and I felt better. And you were magically healed. And I was mmm. That's amazing. Done. That's amazing. That was like that was my first ever my first ever Eklan, anything to do with entertainment. And I worked for twelve hours for just just for like five scenes. Jesus. Why? Because you kept fucking up? No, because they need a lot of backup. They need the best oh. version. Oh you know? let's say you have one take, you do one take. Good, your take is amazing. Uh -huh. Let's do another one. Oh, but you do it any again anyways, even yeah, if it's yeah, good. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just so they have stock to pick from, right? Yeah. I always thought that your first time was um, small sign That was my first ever sinetron. Mm. I got into Iklan when I was in high school. Oh, I did not know that. When I was eight, I was eighteen years old. I was a senior, and it was a Friday. I was. I was having a, 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 I was having cereal <laughs> on a Friday morning, and is, I is that relevant? To this the is story? very relevant okay. because I know Friday, my friends are gonna come over and they're gonna wanna invite me out. Mm -hmm. And at that time, I had no money. <laughs> I was broke as fuck, <laughs> right? I don't get allowance, you know. I'm 18 years old. I'm preparing for getting ready to go to school, eating my cereal, and I'm thinking, <coughs> man. I could use some money, you know? Mm -hmm. But, and then I started thinking about it, like who the fuck is gonna hire an 18 year old who hasn't even finished high school, has no relevance in anything? And then I was thinking about it for a bit, and I'm like, dude, entertainment industry. So I thought like, I have a chance. Mm -hmm. So I did it, I looked up online, like casting places in South Jakarta. Casting couch? Different. Oh, different, and then that kind. And I <laughs> went there. I went to the casting places, like, knowing nothing. Dude, that's <laughs> fucked up. Well, I, I, I knew that they had, like, castings there, but I just went up there. No, and but I'm you like, went by yourself. I didn't. I went with my girlfriend at the time. She, okay. She encouraged me, and she wanted to come with me. Great. Okay. Because uh, I, I, that was also uh, a further question I wanted to ask. Like, did you go, was that, like, your own conscious decision? Did someone hit, say, like, yo, you should try no, it No, well, it was my conscious decision to actually do... Uh, to try and make more money through commercials mm. but it was my girlfriend at the time who really pushed me like you know you want it because sometimes I'm I'm I can be a bit labile like yeah, yeah, I yeah. want something but then I don't really want to chase it yeah, yeah, but, yeah. but she helped me like she pushed me like come on we're gonna get it done I'm like okay so she ended up like searching online she was the one who searched online uh. she found the place and she's like that's where you're going later after school I'm like shit okay trust, 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 trust. and she came with me trust, trust, trust. Terus itu iklan apa gitu gue lupa castingnya And I casted the first every time I went inside the casting room It was such a small room, isi kayak 10 orang Kayak segini, studio ini Jauh lebih kecil Hah? 10 orang? 10 orang, so there's like There's a there's a camera over there There's one or two people who are doing the acting And there are just people, all the other contestants Ngantri gitu Just ngantri di dalam ruangan Anjing 
Males gak sih? Males lah Apalagi untuk gue yang belum pernah Belum ada pernah ya Ini pengalaman pertama This your Terus gue diliatin sama yeah, orang-orang yeah, yeah. So I was there And I was I did my best And apparently I really sucked You didn't get it I didn't get it But the guy The The director Of photography at the time Director he, of penetration yeah, yeah He really He thought that I had potential So A lot of people sometimes when they fail He's just like Okay next Yeah, yeah. But when I failed, he's like, you know what, Jao, you should try do this next time. Let's have another take. Hold it like this. Be a little bit more. Like he was this. willing to invest. He was in willing you. to invest yeah, in me. Yeah. He said, he, because I don't know, maybe he thought I could get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I did it seven times, seven takes uh, with all these cunts just watching. He believed me. in you. That he believed in me. Yeah. What a good guy. This little you know, remember I, his name? I know. Name? Yeah, no, Chill with I, I know. That's I know crazy. him. I, I, like whenever I see him, he's in. Uh, he's. In a production house in uh, Kemang right now. So I so I was doing that. I was doing commercials, and every single time I casted, I casted like I went every day for like five days on every commercial that they had to offer yeah. at that place. Let's say I, you go to one place, there's castings for like four or three commercials. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did every single one, and Holy I got denied shit. in all of them. Holy all shit. of them denied, 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 denied <laughs> until like my ninth one, I got accepted. Holy and was, that was Obeha. It was Obeha. And then after Obeha, I got another call. They told me I got accepted for another thing as well. I got accepted for two more things. So I got Obeha. Do you remember what it was? No, I don't remember. I got Obeha. Oh, I do remember. I got Obeha and I got uh, Permen Kiss. Oh, yeah. Yang merah itu kan? Yang merah itu, yeah. Permen Kiss and another one. Lupa. But those two, mereka bentrok. Kenapa? Harinya bentrok. Oh, so, barangan gitu. So I had to pick one, and I chose Kiss because I had a bigger budget. Yeah, of course. So after all those rejections, I got accepted one, and then I got accepted two. I got accepted three. Last I got accepted snowball four. Snowball gitu ya. I think it was because I failed so many times that I ended up becoming comfortable and not shy. Uh, so like my ninth time when I got accepted with Obeha was because my audition was good because I was already comfortable. I already knew what I was doing. Yeah, because you were so fucking used to like. I was used to it. I wasn't. I wasn't shy anymore. You know. Yeah. Udah nggak ngenciut. Yeah. Udah nggak kaku. I'm like, ah, bro. Come on. Let's do it. Let's yeah, get it over yeah, with. Yeah, yeah. You weren't born into the industry like a lot of like anak artis mm -hmm. is. You know. You literally tried from like zero because like there was no sense of um, importance about you. Right. You, you know what I'm trying to say? I understand. Yeah. Like I'm just another guy. Exactly. Do you think the experience is completely different? Let's say Indonesia. And entertainment in Indonesia, they tend to look for famous people. <clears throat> you have okay, you have different types of producers or directors. Producers, basically, you're looking. F you have some producers who just care about how much they can make, and you have producers who care about making a good movie. Like true artists, artists, seniman, yeah, or cash grabbers. Yes, sometimes they just make movies and they hire people. They hire actors and actresses. Who have like a large following base, so that people so watch. that people yeah, watch yeah. because it's like loyalty, you know. They wanna they they they're relying on their loyalty to buy tickets, which then comes back to them. Understood. Instead yeah, of, yeah, yeah. In a, instead of like actually having the right person for the job exactly, or something, exactly, right? Exactly. <clears throat> so there's this one time I was oh I remember now <clears throat> I auditioned for a movie. <laughs> Why you? Why you so shocked? Oh, you're really close to my cock. Okay. Uh, I I I auditioned for a movie, and then there was this girl. I knew this girl. She cute. Yeah, 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 she's she's pretty cute. Yeah. And I went outside and I saw her. Yeah. And I was talking to her for a bit, and then it turns out I was talking to her, and she told me that this producer is only looking for people who have like over one million followers on uh. Instagram. What if you have like some guy who auditioned and is actually like really fucking good and can do his job as that role? Yeah, but because you won't bring the extra but views. But you won't bring the extra viewers. Yeah, that's fucked. You have met people who are like dedicated to their craft, right? Like, of course. They want to make it of course. good. They don't really care if like... No, no, no. These guys are... I, I know a lot of people who are like true, genuine artists by heart, by soul, bro. Mm. They're really dedicated to what they do because that's their passion they like creating mm -hmm. and I've seen them at their lows and at their highs and usually they started out slow yeah. and slow 
and gradual, and eventually they started getting huge roles and they became big names. Yep. Night chips. <laughs> Dude, okay. Um, I have more clips. This clip is one of my favorite clips. Um, it's actually two different scenes, but I compiled them together. So, yeah, before, before we go any further, let's just watch the clip, right? Yeah, yeah, that's something. Yang ini aja udah ngedeketin. Oh, pansi lu pada. Eh, yuk. Kamu mau sesuatu nih sama lu? Gue jujur ya. Gue tuh udah lama banget suka sama si Neng. Gue sekarang mau minta pendapat lu nih. Iya. Gue boleh gak deketin si Neng? Kenapa lu harus tanya gue? Ya iyalah, Jul. Gue harus tanya pendapat lu. Kan lu pengen deket sama si Neng. Jadi gue harus tanya dong. Gimana nih? Boleh kan gue deketin si Neng? Ya itu sih terserah lu berdua aja. Jangan-jangan lu suka ya sama si Neng? Polos banget muka lu, Cuk. Cuma. Hei, ini lagi. Tiba-tiba lu suka sama si Neng? Apaan sih lu pada? Gak mungkin lah gue suka sama Neng. Bagian juga, gak mungkin juga gue pacar sama orang buta. Anjir. Eh! Gak mau ajar lu ya! Eh! 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 Biar pun Neng buta! Itu teman musi lu tau gak sih? Lanjang ngomong lu! Damn son. That's intense. Ah, itu siapa yang neng sih? Pacar bukan, saudara bukan. Gak usah so ngatur deh. Itu bukan urusan lo. Oh, I remember this. Tiga Arvin gua, gua takut banyak ngomong. Dia pipisnya lagi, pipisnya lagi dengan yang dipukul. Ada apa ni kali pada? Only I got a hit off him. Yeah. No, you 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 know something funny actually. When we shot that, I accidentally hit him for one. So he wasn't acting. No, you. But I just grazed him like. Oh. Just his nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I actually hit him for real that time. Dude, why does that why does that one guy um. He doesn't want Matt to have kids or some shit. He doesn't want. Kenapa? Kenapa dia selalu nyincar pipis? Like every other punch is like down, you know, because the face. Because that's if you want to hurt them, that's where you get them. In the pipis. Get them in the pipis. Guys, if you guys ever get get into a fight, don't try and look cool. Don't fight. Don't fight like with honor. Fight to win, bro. Punch him in the dick. Punch him in the. Punch him in the. Punch him in the pipis. Fight dirty, dude. But I uh, actually seeing that made me. Please don't. If you guys ever get into a fight, just don't get into a fight. Run away. Go the other way. Don't punch him in the peepus. <laughs> peepus. Peepus. Dude, I actually granted like an extra level of respect watching that because I genuinely think I don't think I would have been able to like do that with like keeping a straight face. Dude. But that's where I also got lucky because my first sinatron was with Matt. So I had someone I knew, which I could rely on. Yeah, yeah. To give me, you know, in a, in a new situation, there's like Matt, who's a friend, which brings comfort. I'm not really a professional actor. I was doing it just for a bit. I wouldn't say I'm good at it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm sure there are so many other people. There are so many other people who could just pull up and like bring their A game. Langsung jalan aja. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I don't know, man. Like, I've never tried, so I wouldn't know. But I'm guessing. It's the opposite for me. Like I, th I feel like if it was someone I didn't know, mm. it's purely professional. Mm. Like let's do this. I'm gonna punch you in the mm. face. But if it's like you, I would just laugh, dude. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't be able to punch you in the face. I'd just be like, I'd laugh the whole time. And then in that scene, you're like, like you look fucking well, pissed. <laughs> well, we do because so, because we're also kind of cunts, right? Yeah, yeah. So sometimes we sh we. When it's someone's turn to close up, Misanya, it's your turn to close up. Oh, you'll be there. Like, I'll be there. I'll be like. <laughs> You know? You know. And then Matt's like, Joe, Joe, Joe! Itu Joe kayak gitu, gua kayak, huh? Apa sih? That's fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is the last thing about um the small sayang neng sinetron that I want to show you. I made, I made a meme, right? Okay. Alright, listen. Neng, kok ngelamun sih? Mikir apa? Gue gak ngelamun, Axel. Gue buta. What did What did he expect? Yeah, what did he expect from asking that? Yeah. 
because there's nothing to look she's, at, she's dude. She's trying her best, dude. She's trying her best. That's hilarious. That, that's what you call amazing script writing. <laughs> Good job, dude. How, how was your experience, like, um, in general? Because, <clears throat> like, dude, that was, like, more than 20 episodes, right? For that one Sinatran? Which one? Uh, so well, saying, I mean. No, bro. That was only 13 episodes. We didn't do so well. 13? That but that's quite a lot. No, it's not. No, it's not. How is it going to be more than how many seasons are there? Kalau kayak sinetron yang jalan bagus. Kalau yang jalan bagus ratusan. Ratusan? Ratusan kalau yang bagus banget ya. That's fuck. Where did it sell short? Because like, did a lot of people were watching. There was a lot of internal problems as well. Okay. Like between actors, uh, like some people still had school to juggle. Ah, uh, okay, okay. And uh, so it wasn't like the marketing or the selling the actual. No, no. Well, it was too early to tell for semua sayang but it was just too too many. It was too problematic for it to. It began with so much problems and it just kept building up. Did it end like abruptly or like was yeah. there like some sort of closure to it? I don't even remember, dude. You know, because you remember. were one of the main fuckers. You have pretty big like. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was one of the main characters. Do you, are you still f- friends with like um, with the cast? Like with how 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 is how does friendship last in the industry? Is it like well that depends. If you're still an artist, then you're probably still gonna be friends. But I'm not in that entertainment industry. How much of those cunts would you still like if you saw them? Like you'd be like you'd have a coffee with them or something. I, I there's probably a handful of them which I would still enjoy a drink or two or fourteen. Or but most of it is just a professional job. Yeah, isn't it? most of them I wouldn't see again. Okay. Okay. First guy you got is Jahar. Hell yeah, bro. It's a pretty shitty start. Exactly. No <laughs> budget. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. Uh, my friends. <laughs> friends. Oh, <dude. laughs> Yo. <laughs> yeah. And all I hear is pew pew pew. Yeah. So, whiskey's on you? Let's go out if you want. Let's go for a drink or something. Look at downstairs for a coffee first. Should I get a clean up? <laughs>